Michael Gentile looks like he could be the grumpy old grandfather next door. But what kind of sick senior citizen would send your kids a perverted picture like this? Or leave your little girl the most disgusting voicemails imaginable? Hey, my little sex kitten. How are you, sweetheart? Gentile is the latest creep I've caught in our special investigative series, Hanson vs. Predator. I can't wait to kiss you and to hold you. Over the years, I've caught more than 300 of them. Why don't you take a seat right over there? But let me tell you, Gentile is one of the worst I've ever seen. His aggressive attempts to seduce a 13-year-old will turn your stomach. I want to make you so happy, my little angel. I love you, baby, so much. And you'll be shocked when you hear what cops say Gentile was planning. A kiddie porn manufacturing site. Gentile is much older than most of the predators I catch. He's 64. He says he's a limo driver. He likes to play drums and he loves to run around in the nude. His email address says it all. Love to be naked. Our sting takes place in Fairfield, Connecticut, a quintessential New England town some 50 miles from Manhattan. Predators don't only roam the big city, but they control the suburbs too. It could be a guy like Gentile driving across state lines to have sex with a minor, or even the guy down the street, like Charles Lawrence. No, Chris, what are you doing here? I know Lawrence. We used to take the same commuter train into the city. I was shocked when he showed up at our sting house to chill with a 13-year-old boy. What are you doing here? Chris, please. I know, but we'll, we'll, you'd have to explain this. All right. Come here, man. Today, it's Gentile who's on the police radar. So with the cooperation of the Fairfield cops, we set up a sting operation. You should have that taser out. Placing more than a dozen hidden cameras all over, in water bottles, in trash cans, and on the fence. The police are also working with Tetrad Corps, a watchdog group working to expose online predators. I don't have uh, sex or anything on this, this local guy. That's Lori from Tetrad. She's one of the operatives who communicates with the predators. I'm just really scared. Can you prove to me right now you don't have a gun? The on-site decoy is a 19-year-old theater student who is posing as a 13-year-old girl. On social media, Tetrad posts innocuous pictures of real underage girls. Tetrad never makes the first contact. It doesn't take long for the rat named Gentile to crawl out of the sewer and contact the decoy we will call Brittany. I love you so much, baby. Gentile sends pictures of himself naked posing in front of a mirror, in the woods, even sitting on the toilet. His text messages are some of the raunchiest and most disgusting imaginable. Many we can't even put on TV, but most involve Gentile's love for nudity. I sent you a picture on Skype. I'm naked. I would kiss you all over, LOL. Yesterday, I went to a river upstate and went nude sunbathing. Do you want to go with me, LOL? Will you try sleeping naked tonight? I sleep naked every night. He sends Brittany links to porn videos, asking her to watch and learn. Remember, he thinks he's talking to a 13-year-old girl. I want you to feel comfortable looking at naked human bodies. I also want you to learn what they're doing. Watching those movies is your sex education homework, he says. I'm going to give you a test on it tomorrow. Gentile asks her to get a banana and do unmentionable things with it. It's just practice for when the real thing ever happens. I want you to imagine that the banana is me. He reveals what could be interpreted as a passion for pedophilia. We went on a tour today of an old castle on the Hudson River. There were two girls around your age. I was looking at those girls today thinking of you and getting so excited. What is even more disturbing, Gentile sent pictures of what appears to be child pornography. Then he asks Brittany something that will come back to haunt him. Can I take pictures of you? Yeah, maybe. LOL, no one will see them though, right? just me. I would never want to see my sweetheart with anyone. That is child pornography. There's a varying degree of what their intent is, what their actions are, and what they plan to do. After about a month of his almost constant texting, it's time to reel in this slimy fish. Tetrad's decoy leaves him a message. Her parents will be gone the following weekend. Gentile, who calls his wife the witch, tells her he's going out to help a friend. He drives 35 miles from Brewster, New York, to Fairfield. The decoy asks him to come in through the side door. I'm sorry, can you just get this for me? I'm going to be so bad. Seconds after he's in the hallway. I'm really sorry. 
Next, the confrontation. Mike. Mike. And the shocking items found in his hotel room. 